Good evening, I'm Victoria Idoni. And I'm Mark Kiesling. Strong storms ripped through the region last night, leaving some folks with a mess on their hands. Meteorologist J.C. Brienne caught up with residents in Perry County who took a hard hit. I've lived here in Cutler for over 20 years, and I've never had it get, I've never seen it like this. Monday night storms wreaked havoc in Cutler. Local resident Mary Dobbins says she rode out the storm in her home. I said, I think we're really gonna be getting hit. And before I could get the words out of my mouth, we was already getting hit. The whole front of my door, you couldn't even look, I couldn't even look out here. Large tree limbs blocking Dobbins' front door trapped her inside her house until her nephew came to help. He came over and uh, hacked it all up with a machete knife thing and then pulled it over here so we could get, get it out of the way, at least so we could get out of the house. Dobbins' Jeep was also crushed by debris, shattering the windshield. And just up the road, a camper was buried underneath a large tree. It kind of looked like a scene out of Twister. I mean, it was, it was scary, especially for my kids, you know, my family. Um, it got dangerous really quick. Cutler resident Timothy Hendricks says he was left with large tree limbs and no power after the storm, but he was just relieved that no one was hurt. I'm just glad none of us was hurt. I mean, all this is bad. But I mean, lives can't be replaced. In Cutler, meteorologist J.C. Brienne, News 3.